Uh, Governor LePage, thank you for spending time with us on your first trip to Montenegro. I understand Montenegro and Maine share many similarities. Can you tell us about your state? Yeah, our state is um, it's, it's quite a bit larger than uh, Montenegro, but it's got a very small population, only about a million people. The country, uh, the state is about the size of Ireland, so it's, it's a fairly sizable uh, state. It's very mountainous, and we have a coastline, not dissimilar to Montenegro, and uh, fiercely independent people. I understand that Montenegrins are a little bit independent at times. And stubborn, did I hear that, stubborn? Well, we're stubborn too. <laughs> so we're very, very similar in that respect. The main Montenegro state partnership program was signed 12 years ago in 2006. What is the goal of the program? Well, actually, it started out uh, sort of uh, uh, disaster relief and emergency management and uh, border security and, and uh, you know, working with police officers to share the technologies. But I think as it's developing, uh, now it's heading into a new, a new era, and I think there's cooperation and education between the two countries, uh, cultural and uh, education and economic. I, I really hope that uh, our countries, uh, uh, the Maine and Montenegro, develop a good economic trade and we're going to be bringing back uh, uh, Monte Montenegro's wine and we're going to be selling it in Maine, so we're starting. <laughs> so is that how would you like Montenegro and Maine partnership uh, to evolve? I, I think it would be great if we could share our languages more. In fact, we were talking last evening and probably I'm gonna, when we go back, I'm gonna work with the university and see if we can't get uh, your language taught in our state and having English taught in this country. And so maybe that will help develop the relationship much quicker. And what have you heard about Montenegro? What would you like to see and do on your visit? I want to see everything and anything that is possible in the short time that we're here. But what I've heard, the thing that I've heard that's the most interesting is that while there's been difficulty in the Balkans for many, many years, that everybody likes Montenegro. So that's, that sounds good because everybody, if Montenegro is friends to everybody, then Maine wants to be part of Montenegro. <laughs> Thank you, Governor. Very good. It's a, it's a pleasure to be here. And uh, we're going to bring you a wine and we're gonna send you some lobster. <laughs> Thank you very much.